sponge painting is an easy and inexpensive way to give your walls texture and depth. It also offers the practical benefit of covering flaws and imperfections. Follow these steps to learn this simple technique to transform the look of your walls. Now before you begin, you should remove or cover your furniture and protect the floors with a drop cloth. Now, mask off the area where you will be working with painter's tape. Now, to prep the surface, make sure to fill any cracks or holes with spackling. You will need at least two colors for this technique. We're gonna use four to give our wall a variety of texture and dimension. You can use the same color family going from dark to light, or if you wanna create some contrast, use complementary colors. Now the next step is to apply a base coat. Our ivory base coat has a built-in primer. Now if your base color does not, be sure to prime your wall first. Now roll on your paint with a nine inch roller and make sure you give the walls a nice even coat. Then let it dry for 24 hours before continuing. Now you will use a natural sea sponge to apply the paint. So begin to gently sponge on the paint. Apply just enough pressure to create detail. And rotate your hand to get alternate patterns with the sponge on the wall. You can stop after two colors, but we're having too much fun. So we're gonna apply some additional colors for more dimension once we finish this one. Now after we have given the paint time to dry, let's roll on a tan color over the gray. You can use a sponge roller to cover your wall faster. Now once you are happy with that shade, you can come back and apply an accent color periodically. We're gonna add some pops of white for brightness. Another application you can use is the sponge off technique. Time is critical in sponging off because you must work before the paint dries. Have a pile of clean dry paint rags or dry sponges handy to blot paint off the wall to create texture. Mm, nice. A great technique for painting your corners is to use a piece of cardboard to block off one wall as you apply paint with a sponge into the corners of the adjoining wall, like this. Sponge painting is truly an art form and you can continue to add and blot away until you get a look that fits your design. Our walls turned out beautiful, and this technique really transformed the space. Now, you can take on sponge painting your walls like a pro. Here's a list of tools and materials you will need. Good luck, and thanks for shopping at the Home Depot.